Hi, welcome to the Northern Virginia Market Watch, brought to you by RBI, Real Estate Business Intelligence, an MRIS company. We're going to dig into the most recent numbers from the Northern Virginia housing market, which includes the counties of Arlington, Fairfax, Fakir, Loudoun, and Prince William, as well as the cities of Fairfax, Falls Church, Manassas, Manassas Park, and Alexandria. Every day... You may have noticed some noise lately about where the market is heading. Some accounts are optimistic, while others, well, aren't. Needless to say, they can't all ring true. The good news is that local data provides a more reliable tone than national soundbites can offer. When it comes to hearing the market's true message, it may not necessarily be from the usual indicators, it may not be heard evenly across all segments, and it may arrive in disjointed bursts. In fact, some of those hidden signals may be audible right now. Let's listen. Pending sales increased 21.2% over June 2010 to arrive at 3,322 for the month. That means more consumers were both willing and qualified to enter into purchase agreements. Changes of that magnitude may be partially attributed to declining activity at this time last year. That's not necessarily a bad thing, but it's still a thing you should be aware of. Those gains in buyer activity have really drawn down the inventory of available homes for sale. If this were an Economics 101 class, the professor with the bow tie and corduroy sport jacket would be lecturing about how consumer demand has effectively absorbed the existing supply. But seriously, it has. Inventory levels were down 20.8% to 8,997 units. We were indeed able to move the price needle upwards. The median sales price was up 6% over June 2010 to an even $400,000. Many people are keeping a close eye on seller concessions. As the market tides begin to turn, sellers can expect to receive more and more of their asking price. For now, percent of original list price received at sale decreased 1.1% to land at 96.5 for the month. That means the market slightly favored buyers but is still in balanced territory. On the national front, the interest rate dropped to 4.88% on a 30-year fixed conventional and 4.52% for FHA. The unemployment rate inched up to 9.2% though initial unemployment claims continued to fall. Overall, the Washington, D.C. region is well poised for sustained recovery. Housing demand is almost guaranteed to outstrip supply once the current lending environment relaxes. Promising long-term employment prospects, as well as constrained land development, are also cause for optimism. That's the Northern Virginia Market Watch for this month. Check back next month for the latest. (music) 